What's up guys, welcome back to GTA, we're just crashing into shit as Michael on our way to Martin Madrazo's house. Uh, I think we either got a text or a call from him, I'm not sure because I don't really check my text messages, and we're driving so now is definitely not the time to do so, but uh, he's going to give us a mission, I think, something like that. Oh, I believe Trevor's involved, if not now then eventually. Uh, yeah, yeah. You don't want to wreck the place. It's got a nice joint here. <sighs> Stolen car. Here he is. What is this? It's a thing. You said you wanted work. This is work. Uh huh. And who's the guy? You'll see. Yes. Hi. <laughs> oh. We're looking for Mr. Madrazzo. Patricia, for fuck's sake, just let him in. Right this way, gentlemen. <laughs> Patricia, get us something to drink, would you? Quickly! Hey, good to see you again, Michael. <laughs> Likewise. Uh, this is my friend Trevor. Uh, sit down. Sit, sit, sit. So, what did you tell him about me, about Martin Madrazzo? Uh, Martin's an old friend of mine, Trevor. The He's... truth. Martin is a terrifying psychopath who tried to kill me. Exactly. Uh, but some people, <laughs> they no longer fear me as much as they used to. People who wear clothes to me. Uh, my cousin, uh, you met in my call. <laughs> well, apparently, he's thinking about testifying against me. So I have him killed. I'm going to. Yeah. By you. Our debt was settled. This is a favor. We're a friend. What does friendship mean nothing these days? Ah, uh, hello? What's the deal? This is him. Javier. He's flying off to Liberty City this afternoon. <whistles> and he's taking some files of mine. Innocent files that um, I need back. There's a gun set up in the hills. I have a man watching at the airport. We'll let you know, and when he flies by, shoot him down and get the files back. A man, what's a pay? <laughs> huh? Trevor, come on. You still want a drink? Not now! Pendeja! Que no ves que estoy hablando con las gentes aquí? All right, you grab a vehicle, something versatile. I'll handle the gun. All right! Can do, all right. So, Madrazo's a prick to his wife. Where's my car? You need on the headset and uh there we go didn't mean to do that but okay oh it went back down <laughs> there we go all right so some of you might be wondering the hell do you need a gun if you're trying to take down an airplane well We'll see about that in about 1.75 miles. Oh! This was a nice car! Was! Until we stole it and fucked it up. Don't try to antagonize from Michael, you know what you did. Yeah, 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 Hong Kong, welcome to LA. Or SA, whatever. You know the deal. Woo! Hey! Yep. I'm glad you didn't finish that right after turn this around and beat you senseless. <laughs> he apologized. Oh shit. <laughs> yeah. Oh, sorry. I don't oh. I got some poor bastard's dirt bike. Yeah, okay. Well, I ain't at the observatory yet. Start heading that way. Understood what? That he's a terrifying psycho and that you might have that in common? What is it? We gotta work for him. We don't gotta work for anyone, but I read you, man, loud and clear. What are you talking about? All that Aztec stuff. Those weird little artifacts. What? The little fertility statues, whatever. The guy has trouble getting it up. We'll clear two, three million on those. Easy. Perverts will pay anything for hope. We weren't casing the joint. We didn't agree to a fee for this job. 
job. So what's it all about? Okay. The guy lives well. That don't mean we're robbing him, but it does mean he's got money to pay people who help him. When the time comes, he'll do the right thing. If he don't, please, let me handle it. You don't get a wife like that without being rich and an asshole, right? The fuck? <laughs> <laughs> All right, I see the reaction. You nearby? Not far out. Shoot the plane down and I'll be ready. Okay. So, where's this gun? Huh? Holy shit. Okay. I've never seen that before actually. I, I I usually just get in the van, but if you look, it's uh like some Call of Duty thing, you know? It's a little bit smaller than I expected. Uh, okay. Cool. See, if you could see this gun, it might convince you Martin Madrazo ain't someone to be messing with. The fancier the gun, the bigger the pussy who owns it. Now take down the jet. Where is it? I'm so, I remember getting confused at this spot, too. Let me, uh, check my map here so I can see I'm po at least pointing it in the right direction. Uh... Okay, I'm not. <laughs> I got her. Southwest of the city. Do I? I, I don't fucking see it. For the speed of the jet. Uh, oh, there it is. Alright. Uh, oh, shit. Nope. Got it. You hit it once, it starts going all crazy. Take another shot. Oh, this thing's. Give me a second. All right. You can just spam bullets. It's semi-automatic. That'll go down next time. What? How did I fail? The plane got too close to the airport. <laughs> All right, so you got to get it right in that square. I am not a marksman. Whoopsie. <laughs> so I would try to get it as early as possible. There it is. Out past downtown. The jet's moving. All right, that one hit. Not good enough. There we go. Yeah, definitely get it when it's early and further away. That didn't do it. There we go. First strike. The plane's coming down. You want it? Conveniently enough, right next to where we're parked. So, you just gotta follow this thing. Pretty easy to spot. It's burning like crazy. And off road we go. There's a small jump coming up. Oh, I wanted to do a backflip. That's not nearly not nearly enough air. This is flight November 9 to Charlie Echo. Oh shit. Our engine number two is blown. Roger November 9 Charlie Echo. Oh shit. Oh, okay, it's a tunnel. <laughs> oh, this is a race this is a race course in multiplayer. I remember doing this. And thinking that it was awesome. Gone, you say? What took them? Alright. Come on, Trevor. Hard to miss. Landing ain't gonna be pretty. I could have landed that bitch.
you flew right over the airfield. What the hell are you doing? You know what? <laughs> In That's awesome. I can say what I want about the multiplayer, but single player, dead on. Awesome. It's like an... Oh, that guy was taking a picture with his phone. That guy, that guy we passed was taking a picture of the plane going down with his phone. That's so cool. funny that uh, we passed Trevor's house and he yelled at Ron. <laughs> he was like, you better be working. Michael has a really weird way of doing things. Can't remember. Oh, never mind. <laughs> no spoilers, but. Okay, leave the area. In the van, really? Okay. What the? <laughs> I don't remember what comes next. Well, I do, but I don't remember why we're playing as Michael. I don't know if I'm supposed to be heading this way or... Oh, okay. Uh, drive up here. Oh, Jerry can how convenient. Um, in case you guys didn't know, I've heard a lot of people. By heard a lot of people, I mean I talked to a lot of people online. And many of them think that gas is useless for blowing up cars because all it does is pop the tires. But the tires are actually what you want to pour the gas on. And, uh, of course, in front of the engine block. But um, in case you didn't know... you want to set this thing on fire in the front and along the tires I don't know why they... oh okay yeah go to Madras fucking A <laughs> I, rem I was remembering something I'm like there's something that happens after you destroy the van and it's you're stranded in the middle of fucking nowhere without a car not the middle of nowhere, at least there's a vehicle right here, but it's a bit of a oh what? What do you want, Trev? There's been a change of plans. You don't need to come to the ranch. Meet me at Stoner Cement Works. A little up Sonora Road from there. What are you doing, Trevor? Nothing you wouldn't do. I highly Trevor. doubt that. I wouldn't do. Somehow I don't believe that. No, you shouldn't. Oh, it's a beautiful day, Michael. Don't. What did you just say? All right. 
What is this? A what? A felon? Oh, the felon! This is a four door, right? No, it's a two door, even though there's four seats. Another feature I'm not too proud of. I shouldn't have shot her. Because now, now the cops got a hard on for me, but. Uh, easy way to beat that. Go off road! Because they don't follow you off road. Well, yeah, I don't really think they do. What the fuck was that? Oh, it was, an an it was a jaguar. I'm so used to playing multiplayer and not seeing animals that weirded me out a bit. Get back here. I remember you guys from Red Dead. I remember you. I remember that time I was... I just got that horse, the black one. What is it? The American Standard Bread? And it took me forever to find it. I went everywhere, I chased it, it took me like three tries to wrangle it. This fucking thing comes along, kills it. And me. Bullshit. You. Fuck you. I hate those Jaguars. <laughs> anyway. Uh, we're gonna go meet Trevor. Yeah, one thing GTA loves to do, oh, this one likes to do anyways, give you a waypoint, and you're like, ah, oh, shit, I gotta drive there. <laughs> you spin me right round, baby, right round. There we go. Uh, what they love to do is say, hey, go there, and you're like, damn, I don't want to go all the way over there now that I just lost my car. Then they're like, phone call, no, no, you don't have to go there. You have to go here. It's about twice as far, and you don't have a car, so... Well, you obviously have to steal one or run there or something, but it's a bitch. Won't lie. There we go. Perfect. This car was meant for off-road. And we're here. Sorry. I'm here. Do I have to park in the circle? What's up? Where is he? Oh, don't tell me you're gonna do that time lapse shit. How long are you gonna be waiting here, Michael? Oh no. of turd, huh? No wonder people are stabbing him in the back. What happened? Cheap bastard. You know, I really don't know why you mess around with people like that, Mike. I mean, really, I Trevor! don't. Answer a fucking question. I asked for a fair day's pay after a fair day's work. Then he kind of got a little angry. So I admit, I kind of got a little angry. Did you kill him? What kind of fucking animal do you take me for? No, I didn't kill him. <laughs> but I did kidnap his wife. Oh, no. Oh, shit. What the fuck did you do? Oh, I just told you what I just did. Now, oh, shit. Uh, unfortunately, I think that we're going to have to lay low for a little while while, you know, we discuss things with Martin. Oh, you think? Why don't you pop in the back? All right now, Patricia. She already called shotgun. <laughs> now I know a nice little place we can hang out. You know, it's a, a very relaxing little spot. A little getaway, if you will. A cabin in the woods. You know what I'm saying. Thank you. I'm really glad I don't have to drive over there. Please switch me out to Franklin. Do it. Yes! Yes! <laughs> I was hoping I really didn't have to do that. Anyway. Whoa, what? Uh, what are you doing all the way out here, Franklin? Come on. Are you running with chop? Right. Hey, buddy! Ooh, 
cool. Anyway, let's get back in our car. Are we gonna get a phone call? What's up? Get inside, chop. Get him, buddy. Yeah. Sweet. All right, guys. So thank you very much for watching. And if you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to leave me a thumbs up, comment to let me know what you think, and favorite also to really help me out. Um, it's actually a fun one. That's probably one of my... These missions are so well done. I almost ran that dog over. Oh, I'll just run your owner over. Uh-huh. Not an animal killer. <laughs> anyway, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, this episode was loads of fun. If you haven't bought this game, I seriously recommend it. The single player is amazing, and it's totally worth the $60 if you don't plan on playing the multiplayer. If you plan on playing both, it's definitely worth it, even though I've talked a lot of shit about all the glitches and stuff they've patched. It's still a good game, totally worth it. Um, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.